Do you always dreaming of seeing dead people in your dreams? Do you having a constant dream, seeing your age met, seeing yourself where you have lived before, seeing yourself in the place that you have served before, seeing yourself in with the madam or with your girl you have been or you have served for years ago and you still seeing yourself in that particular place? Are you seeing yourself every time writing an exam in your dream, but yet you cannot write? Like whenever you in the, in the dream, you'll be trying to write the exam, but you don't really know what to write. Or are you the type that anytime that you sleep or whenever you are you are hearing some negative voices and all that please this recipe is really for everybody this is it stands as a spiritual cleansing It's very powerful spiritual cleansing and it's also a very powerful spiritual liberation method for everyone whether you're a man or your woman after doing this believe you me your life will never remain the same so if you want to know more about this what and what you need in doing this and how to do this please do keep watching why I share with you. watching from and exactly where you see this video you are highly welcome back to my channel how are you all doing i hope you are doing well thank you for joining today in case if you are new my name is promise so in this channel i share about the spiritual tips and health tips how to use natural things for these uses so if you find it helpful and something that you want to know more please do subscribe or follow me so that you always notified whenever i upload a video when you ring the bell notification okay so thank you for joining i pray that all your good expectations shall be granted for your returning subscriber thank you very much for always being here i am honored and i pray that god almighty will bless you so guys in today's video like i said this particular recipe it stands as a spiritual cleansing it stands as a liberation all right even if your issue is as a case of family issue by the grace of god almighty who has power over the universe you will surely liberate yourself with this method if at the time that whatever that you are doing are not working very well try this amazing recipe if at the time that people are owning you they refuse to pay you you still try this if you are going through any spiritual problem in this life whatever that it is that you have been praying for and still hoping for god's intervention in your life Please try this amazing recipe with your faith, with your belief, and with your sincere heart. You will surely get that particular thing that you want. Now, this is what you need to do. Please. Now, you get a red oil. All right. Now, when you get a red oil, that's why I said, please, if you are going, if your issue is as a result of family, foundation, generational causes, and all that, please don't joke with this particular recipe. Please don't joke with it. All right. Now, you get a red oil. When you get a red oil, you go and buy yourself a lost soap or a joy soap. Lost soap or joy soap. Now get a new sponge. Not the normal sponge you have been using before. Go to the market and buy a new sponge. Or you get this local sponge that many will use in washing place and all that that has been made from palm tree. Alright. Now you can get any of these. Now, this is what you need to do. You are going to do this particular recipe for seven days. Now, every night, if you want to sleep at night, now you do it when you are already, when you are already ready to sleep. All right. What I mean is that now maybe you've done with your family, you've done pressing your phone. This is time for me to sleep. Now get a bucket of water. Now use any type of bucket except black. All right. Now fill the bucket with water. Now you're going to use that red oil. Use the red oil to start rubbing it as a cream in your body from your hair to your toe. If you're a lady, maybe you make your hair. You can start from your face. You are going to be rubbing it as if you are rubbing your cream all over your body. Make sure it touches every part of your body. Now as you rub it, as you're rubbing it, you're going to have found this. So you're going to be praying. Tell God Almighty that whatever that is causing hindrances in your life, whatever they have projected in your life, 
be it spiritual blockage, be it ocho, be it whether you the ones that you committed yourself. There is some areas that something that some people are going through as a result of what they have committed themselves. If you're a lady, you keep making doing an abortion, it brings a lot of spiritual hindrances. It causes a lot of spiritual downfalls because it's a soul that wants to come to life to fulfill a destiny that you are removing. All right. Sometimes we felt all oh, this is, is not it. Oh, I don't want to come. I don't want to start uh, suffering the child. I don't want to know. You know what to do. As far as God has placed that child, that child has a destiny to fulfill. And there are some children that when you just mistakenly remove them, they are very, they, because they are spiritually strong, they may scatter a lot of things to you, whether you're a man or a woman. So that is why I, I'm why I explained it because some areas some people will be like oh lady P how like mostly you just said there is some hindrances we committed ourselves yes not only that is the hindrances won't commit on themselves if you are the type that you have a jealous heart you are a bite biting somebody this thing stops blessings when good things happen to your neighbor you are not happy it stops blessings. You are the type that you don't have the heart of giving, don't have the heart of helping others. It stops blessings. So there is so many things that we will do commonly that is also as a that brings hindrances in our life, but we don't know. So you are going to be telling God whatever that it is, whether it's known to you or unknown to you, that is a, as a cause of this particular thing that you are going through. Now, if at the time you keep seeing dead people, your village people in your dreams, whatever connection I have, blood connection, foundational connection, lineage, whatever that connected me from these people that I'm seeing tonight, as I am doing this, I am washing it out of my blood, out of my life. You're going to be applying the palm oil as a cream. As you're making this declaration, there is power in your words. The power of riches and poor life and death is in your ways. So you have to speak the one that you want. Then after you don't rub in the oil, all right? Now get that your new sponge and either lost soap, white lost soap or white joy soap. Now you're going to use it to watch your body. You're going to bet with this mixture. Now, after you're done betting, don't clean your body. Now, go when the when the water dried in your body you put on your dresses and sleep now let me tell you some when you start doing this thing you are going to be having a dreams sometimes you'll be a scary or terrible dreams but don't give up all right sometimes you, you just when you start this thing you might start having some unnecessary issues with people around you please be moved you are on your way to the you are on the way to your liberation so you are going whenever you're on this process any negative things you start feelings just be positive about it and pray over it then after you're done betting with it all right now you continue the process like i said you're going to do it for seven days when you complete the seven days now for that particular sponge please don't use it again either you trash it or you dispose it or you burn it anyhow you can dispose it but don't use it in your body again all right but i tell you if you do this recipe like i said like i explained to you for seven days you will see a lot of positive changes in your life if you are the type you keep having bad dreams dead dreams uh, seeing yourself in the old places that dream will stop so do it believe your believe in yourself and focus and pray to God to use this method to deliver you. And believe me, you will surely be delivered. So I wish I share with you. If you find it helpful, please don't forget to share the video. And don't forget to give the video a thumbs up like. And please, if you are not following me or you have not subscribed to my YouTube channel, please do that. There is a lot to learn by God's grace. And your life will not remain the same. Thank you all for watching. Stay blessed wherever you are. And see you in my next one. Stay blessed. Bye.